you're a human, most likely you want to find yourself a good office chair. But most great office chairs like the Herman Miller cost something like $1,000 to $1,500. They will eat your wallet and leave you begging in the streets. And we don't want that, do we? That's where this chair comes into play. A chair that is not too pricey, but at the same time will deliver you all the goodies that you need without needing to sell your kidneys. Manufactured in South Korea and used in staple companies like General Electric, IBM, Manchester United, Samsung, and even e pro eSport teams, you can tell how much credibility this chair has. And no, it's not just a marketing stunt. I have no idea why no one is talking about this chair, but in my opinion, this is the best chair your money can buy at a mid price range. First of all, let's get the obvious out of the way. The chair looks insane. The design is amazing. I don't know about your setup, but I think it's gonna fit well with most setups. If you don't like black, don't worry, you have a gray and blue option, and you also have a gray only option. Then one of my favorite things about this chair, it's adjustability. On this chair, you can adjust the chair seat and move it forwards and backwards to give you more room for different seating positions and to allow for different people's body types, for different body sizes. And this is what makes this chair suit a very wide variety of people. And it makes it really comfortable to sit in many seating positions. Another thing you can do is you can adjust the whole seat to tilt it forwards to give you a more productive experience when you're working because studies have shown forward tilting seats give less back pain and more productivity for those working at companies. And this, by the way, is one of my favorite features about this chair. I really love that feature. It really does make you feel more productive and less likely to be lazy and to just sit in a hunched, slouched over position and be lazy. And yes, like with any modern office chair, the backrest does tilt backwards. You can recline it backwards to any degree you'd like to give you a very good relaxing experience. And, and you can also lock the backrest in the chair to five different angles to find the perfect one for your work needs. Funny thing is, the reclining position on this chair is the comfiest I've ever felt in any other chair before. Now even though all chairs do recline, but this chair has a really smooth feel. It feels premium in some way when you recline, and at the same time it hugs your body in a way that other chairs don't in a reclined position. It provides support, but also provides comfort at the same time and hugs your body in a way that no other chair has done with me before. And given how comfortable it is reclining in this chair, it allows you to chill, have a nap, listen to, the mu to some music, watch some videos, whatever you want to do is going to be really comfortable for a good break when you're working on this chair. So I really did find this chair to be really comfortable in the reclined position and I was like pretty amazed when I first tried to recline on it. And unlike most office chairs where they have the backrest tension knob under the seat in a place you can't reach while you're sitting, on this chair they put it in a place that you can reach while you're sitting, which allows for finely tuning the adjustment of the tension of the backresting. And the cool thing is the tension adjustment knob on this chair is on the lever that also adjusts the height of the chair. So it's really in a convenient place and it allows you to adjust the tension to your perfect needs without feeling too lazy because it's in a place hard to reach. You can also adjust the armrests up and down, sideways, right or left. You can also go forwards and backwards with the armrests. And the maximum weight on the Cetus T50 is 300 pounds. Another cool feature on this chair for people who suffer back pain is the height adjustable lumbar support. You can adjust this lumbar support up and down or you could even go inwards and outwards. I found that this really helps the chair suit many different or a wide variety of people's bodies, which really does help this chair fit anyone perfectly and it also helps increase the comfort and increase the back support of this chair. Personally, I really love the feature of adjusting the lumbar support, but at the same time, on this specific chair, I feel like it is a little bit flimsy, it does feel a little bit cheapish, but honestly, I totally forgive them for that because the chair has so many features that I am so happy and I can't really complain about this tiny problem in the chair. It, although it does feel very plasticky, but at the same time it works fine, it works perfectly well. I'm not sure if it will break soon, but so far it's working really well. However, I don't think the back adjustment is ever going to break because this company has sold more than a million of this chair. And they even say that stacked up would exceed 200 times the height of Mount Everest. Here's what is cool. Thanks to the design of this chair and the way they put the armrests, this chair offers no obstructions whatsoever. What do I mean, you may say? Well, basically, I can sit on this chair in not one, not two, not three, not four, not five, not six, not seven, 
Not eight, not nine, not 10, not 11, not 12, not 13, but 14 different seating positions with maximal comfort. The chair is designed in a way to allow you to entertain any seating position you like with maximal comfort. And if you're wondering about the base of this chair, the base is made of very high quality plastic and the wheels are also plastic based caster wheels. They are made to be used on carpets. If you want to use the chair on hardwood floors, I suggest you buy hardwood wheels for the chair to prevent scratching the hardwood floor. However, these caster wheels roll really smoothly on carpets and I found them to be a treat rolling around. And at the same time, you don't just slide away without trying. They do keep you in place. If you're worried about the plastic in this base, I don't think you should. It really is a high quality plastic. It would have definitely been better if it was metal. However, I really, really embrace it because of how many features this chair has that you can't get everything at a low price. So if you want to get a, low, a very low price chair that has everything, they are going to have some compromises somewhere to be able to produce the chair. But that's okay, because damn, this chair is epic. Now I'm sure anyone buying an office chair is going to be worried about the comfort of the chair. The chair here is very comfortable. The base is, has a pretty thick cushion. It is very soft, but at the same time, it does provide support at the same time. So you don't feel like you're just sinking into this, the base of the seat. No, it provides good support, and it also has a very soft, cozy feel. As for the backrest, it is a breathable mesh material to keep you cool in the hot days of work. The mesh back strikes a great balance between rigidity and support, and at the same time, it will, it's gonna leave you comfortable for working for very long hours. I've tried working on this chair for about eight hour marathons, and I haven't experienced any discomfort whatsoever on this chair. But the best part about this chair is don't worry, even if you do feel any discomfort, just change your seating position with ease, and you're good to go. And, but also something that I've noticed that a trick you can use on this chair is if you do ever feel any discomfort, you could easily just change your seating position or you could just adjust the tilt of the seat forwards or backwards, change your position and you'll feel great again. So overall, there isn't anything in this chair that I can really complain about. The only thing I am a little bit concerned about is the adjustable lumbar support. It does feel a little bit plasticky, but don't worry, it won't break. I've been trying this thing for a good month and I don't feel like it's going to break. And it really does help you adjust the height of the lumbar support to suit your needs. Another feature that would have been loved was maybe a metal base, but at the same time, you can't buy everything at this price. Oh, and here's one more thing that I really loved about this chair. If you're the type of person like me that likes dropping ketchup on their chair while they're eating french fries, then don't worry, you could easily remove the mesh of the chair seat, the, re the mesh is removable and you can wash it and you can put it back. So it really does make keeping your chair clean and stain proof really a breeze. And for, and for those worrying about height on this chair, don't worry, I've let my family members who are about 165 centimeters sit on this chair and they had no problems whatsoever and they find it really comfortable. And personally, I'm 189 centimeters and usually I have trouble with chairs being too short, but this chair supports my neck really well and supports my back really well. So it's pretty good, I think, until up to maybe 195 centimeters. If you're taller than 195 centimeters, I don't think it'll work out for you. But if you're like between 195 to maybe 160 or 155, I think this chair will be great for you. Normally in other chairs, I know that the neck rest doesn't really work for my height, but no, this chair works really well. So now I'm gonna give you the conclusions about the chair and after that I'm gonna be showing you an unboxing and a quick assembly of the chair and showing you how easy it is to assemble. In my opinion, this is one of the office chairs that you can buy that is worth every single penny. And if I compare it to the previous Sihu ergonomic office chair that I reviewed, this definitely beats that out by far. And if I also compare it to another chair that I have used in the past, this easily beats that. So I think this is definitely one of the best chairs that you can get your hands on for this price at least. And finally, the assembly and unboxing of the chair. The unboxing was really premium. I was really surprised how well packaged they packaged this chair and how much padding was inside. And they even provided protective coverings over all the parts of the chair, which I found really nice. Assembling the chair together was more simple than any other chair I've tried assembling before. The instructions are straightforward and easy to follow. I think anyone could easily assemble this chair on their own. And another cool part about the unboxing is that the base of the chair is already pre-assembled with the caster wheels, so you don't need to worry about that extra step, so that saves you some time. First of all, all you need to do is add the gas lift to the base. Second of all, use the box that came with the chair, bring the base of the chair, and 
flip it upside down on top of the box that came with the chair. Next all you need to do is get the backrest, slide it into a specific place in the base of the chair and voila you're good to go. All you have to do is attach the screws now and then after that attach the armrest and finally you pop in the headrest, voila. Your chair is ready to rock and roll. The unboxing is really quick, it took me like 5 minutes and the chair is ready to go. Before I end this video, I'd like to tell you that I'm going to be reviewing the Citus T80. The Citus T80 is going to be a much more premium version of the Citus T50, so make sure to stay tuned. I'll link it at the end of the video, and if you guys want to buy the Citus T50, the links are going to be in the description below. If you enjoyed this review, please make sure to share it with any of your friends who are looking for a good office chair. That would be much appreciated. And if you enjoyed the video, make sure to like, subscribe, comment below. And then you can check out any of the two videos right here. Nope. Have a nice day. Goodbye.